true at all because there are programs that IELTS and other English tests are not required. You need to have a big amount of money in the bank. Great news! Not all the time because there are programs that proof of funds are not mandatory to process your application. It is expensive. False. We have options, and part of it is planning and goal setting. There is an age limit for a study permit. There is definitely no discrimination when it comes to learning new skills or studying a new course. The process is difficult. Not really, because the Visa Center is there for you every step of the way. How much is the cost of my application? The best thing for us to do is to ask the TBC consultants, wherein they will give us the comprehensive pricing scheme depending on the country that what you would like to apply for, the program that you're eligible to take, and the type of visa that you prefer. There are several Filipinos who thinks that immigration is not for them. Pero bago mo sabihin na hindi para sa yong isang bagay, I think you should at least try and understand the process of immigration. I have to call the visa center right now. They offer processing of permanent residency and student visa applications for those who's moving to Australia, Canada, or New Zealand. They don't just tell you to go for it, they go with you through it. Starting from a very detailed assessment, processing of papers, up until you fulfill your immigration dreams. They offer a very flexible payment terms with non-expiry contracts and transferable applications. Marami na silang natulungang magtagumpay sa pangarap na mag-migrate. It's time to make yours happen right now. As an international student in Australia, you get to enjoy their fantastic climate and quality of life. Meet new friends, explore new places, and new culture. You also get to improve your language skills and have an internationally recognized qualification. Being an international student allows you to gain extra points to qualify for permanent resident application. That's right, the Student Visa Program can be your pathway to securing a work permit and permanent residency in Australia. After your study, you may qualify for postgraduate visa and work unlimited number of hours after completing at least two years. You and your spouse can work part-time for up to 20 hours a week and unlimited number of hours during semester breaks. Your partner can also work unlimited number of hours if the primary visa holder has commenced a course towards master's degree or doctorate degree. Shape a better future for you and your family today. Become an international student in Australia. The Visa Center. Shaping a better future. Here are the basic benefits of becoming a permanent resident in Canada. As a permanent resident, you get to work, study, or do business in Canada. Get access to their universal health care. You get the benefit of free education for children up to 18 years old and a highly subsidized secondary education. They also have the Canadian Child Tax Benefit where you get support from the government for raising your children. Unemployment insurance of up to 65%. Social security and age pension for your retirement. As a permanent resident, you also get to sponsor your family as a temporary or permanent resident. And of course, you have the luxury of traveling to and from Canada from the date that your visa has been granted. Experience the beauty of Canada as a permanent resident. And after accumulating years of living in Canada, you can apply for citizenship and hold a Canadian passport. Well, we all know that the Canadian passport is one of the most powerful passports in the world. Be our next successful client. The Visa Center. Shaping a better future. 
All right, hello guys. Good afternoon everyone. At syempre isang magandang Saturday afternoon dito sa Dubai. Ayan, welcome guys to the Visa Center Q&A. And I'm Zuni Sersano. At saka syempre makakasama natin ang aking partner all the way from Philippines. Ayan, hello. Hi, good afternoon there in Dubai and it's good evening here in the Philippines. It's 7.42 in the evening. Ayan, super excited ako today kasi balita ako bigatin yung ating magiging bisita. Hindi lang siya basta representative but the director and owner of a very prestigious school in Australia. So hello, hello po yeah. sa ating mga aspirants dyan. Ayan, syempre Australia naman tayo ngayon. No? Pero syempre bago ang lahat, we apologize for a little delay. Of our Facebook Live today because of some technical issues, kailangan natin to make sure no, that we are going to present our Facebook Live sa mga viewers natin for them to learn, diba? for them to know what are the courses, yung school partner na feature natin today, magkano yung pa- posibly nilang babayaran, what are the student, parang international student support na binibigay mm-hmm. nila, and a lot more. We're also opening our comment section to everyone. If you guys have question about becoming an international student, feel free po to comment. Okay, mention also if from which country you are para ma, 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 ano din natin, ma shout out natin sila dito sa ating Facebook Live. So yeah, syempre, this is, yan. Oh, go ahead. Syempre, Siyempre, pagmamalaki ng school na yan yung kanilang mga advantages para sa mga magiging students nila. Ayan, so wag po kayo mahiyang magtanong. Comment down below para po masagot natin ang inyong mga katanungan. Ayan, at siyempre, before we start and introduce our special guest today, we're going to play couple of our video advertisement featuring siyempre yung mga approved clients natin yes. to Australia. So we will be back after this commercial. Hi po, andito po tayo ngayon sa main office ng The Visa Center and ngayon kasama ko po si JK, granted visa po natin pa Australia. Congratulations! Then Australia kasi uh, meron na rin ako kasing kasama sa work before na Parang ganon. So, may mga friends of friends naman si mama na mga nandun sa Australia. Sabi niya, be, mas maganda nga dito. Masaya at the same time, malungkot kasi syempre maiiwan ko si mama dito. So, parang para sa akin, wow, yung pinaghirapan, lahat, yung pagod nyo, yung team, the visa center, buong team, uh, parang, uh, parang yun na, worth it na, parang nandito na. Uh, sa mga friends ko na gustong mag-apply, nire-recommend ko ang Visa Center. In-encourage ko kayo lahat, dito na kayo magpa-assess. Talagang matutupad lahat ng pangarap nyo dito. Grabe yung support. Nung umpisa hanggang dulo, um, eto na, nandito na, nag-grant na yung visa ko. So maraming maraming salamat po the Visa Center. Mas marami pa kayong matutulungan. Uh, mas maging strong ang company. Uh, mas maging strong kayo as a team. So, marami pa kayong matulungan. Yes, maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat. Yes. Hello po, my name is Joanna Katrina. Uh, yun po, nag-grant na po yung visa ko to Australia with the help of Visa Center team. And um, kung sino pong gusto magpa-assess dyan, arap na, nandito lang po ang The Visa Center. Okay, 
partner, so we are back at yan ang ilang sa mga na-approve na ng mga applicants natin. Ano? Tsaka partner, just for everybody's information, napakadami na po natin na-approve ng mga student visa or international student in Australia. So ilan lang yan sa mga pinaunlakan tayo no? na makapag-share uh, sila ng kanilang mga video, yung mga testimonials about yung... Uh, how good yung service na ino-offer natin na binibigyan natin sa mga kababayan natin. Correct? Yes. Nakaka-proud talaga yung ating mga kababayan na approved. Siyempre, with the help of the Visa Center with more than 20 years of experience. Ayan. So, talagang subok na subok ng the Visa Center. Ayan. So, siyempre, everyone who's commenting right now, those who are asking for our contact numbers, it is in our ticker below. You can send us WhatsApp or you can call us on our landline. And we also have there our email address that you can actually contact or you can also send your updated resume. And of course, Ivan James is watching. Good afternoon, the Visa Center watching from Dubai. And of course, uh, Piti Luna, Nelly. No. Nell. Hi. Hi. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Okay. So ito na, partner. We are very excited for everyone kasi nga has been supporting us with our Facebook Live. Diba? lalo na from our uh, last year na mga episodes, um, he's been really supporting us with, you know, helping our applicants. Yan, napakadaming support ang binibigay ng school na to, no? And we are very glad to be with our special guest today. Kasi guys, like I mentioned, partner, this is Australia again. Australia is very near to Philippines. The time zone is really just... Almost ano the same. Lang, <laughs> yung, yung, yes. yung, yung difference. At hindi siya magastos kapag gusto mong umuwi-uwi, <laughs> if ever, right? <laughs> oh, yes. Dahil malapit lang ang distance. At syempre, even the weather, it's almost the same. So parang nasa mm -hmm. Pilipinas ka lang din. Hindi ka masyadong okay. mahuhumsik. Mm -hmm. At saka syempre, napakalaki na ng community dyan ng Filipino. And of course, hello sa mga viewers natin. Of course, sabi ni Nell, she is from Japan. Japan! Yeah. Yeah, uh, so, <laughs> and of course, we have viewers from Bahrain. Yan ako sa anak na ng conversion na kay lang pera. Kaya wow. Maria Jen, in po uh, pahingi po ng pera. <laughs> Mataas sa <laughs> Western, Western Union. Pa <laughs> Western so, Union pa lang. Oo, oh, friend, mataas ang, ang conversion ng pera ng Bahrain. Sila yung isa sa pinakamataas ang conversion. Kaya yeah. thank you so much Ana, oh. for, <laughs> for for watching. Yeah, so sabi, sabi ni ano ni ni Neil sabi ako nbano daw. <laughs> okay. All right, so I think wag na natin patagalin muna to partner, no? At least for our all of our viewers, please guys, do share our Facebook live, especially if you know anyone, a family member, a friend or within your circle who are interested to say going to Australia, it's either maging permanent resident man yan or maging student. Ayan, and know the benefits later on, we have Apple. Uh, the second half of our Facebook Live para matulungan natin yung mga ibang questions that are not related to uh, international student pero that will connect to PR application nila mm -hmm. later on. So, partner, I'm giving you the floor to introduce our special guest. Of course, I am very honored to introduce to you the owner and director of Australian Technical College, Western Australia. A big round of applause for Mr. Asif Agi. Hello, Hello sir. everyone. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello, Juni. Hi. Hello, Wayne. Hi. How are you? Uh, well, we're good, sir. And we're very happy to have you again in our Facebook Live. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your patience. And I'm so sorry for being delayed. Actually, mm -hmm. I'm out um, with some of my friends for a dinner, but um, we have already fixed a time with you guys. So I'm attending from uh, somewhere which is not my office or not my home, but yes. yeah, definitely we can talk uh, with each other. Uh, so I'm not in rush. Um, I'm happy to share with um, our lovely learners about our college, about our, um, you know, about Australia, about Perth, about Sydney. Uh, so mm -hmm. we have a lot to share. So yeah. So what if I can play a couple of videos earlier? Is it okay? Yes, go ahead, sir. Sure. Okay, ahead. We, will, well, we will give you the floor uh, so that uh, everyone who would like to record our live streaming, they can actually do so. Sure. Thank you. All right. Take it away, sir. In the screen. There you go. In share system audio. Okay. There you go. 
So can you watch the video? Looking for flexible and supportive education provider? Planning for studying in regional Australia? This offers you a nationally recognized qualification. Get help from ATCWA Relocation Support Fund. We are more than happy to assist our lovely learners. If you are seeking for benefits of study in regional Australia, this offer is for you. National recognized qualifications, amazing training facilities, state-of-the-art training staff, trainers will bring you the latest industry knowledge as per the current industry requirements, willing and supportive student support staff, flexible payment plans for your individual needs, study, business, commercial cookery, hospitality management, leadership and management, management learning, and telecommunication and network engineering with us. The courses are designed in a way to make sure when you are leaving you are job ready. Industry placement with a top-notch five-star placement partners. Multicultural students from 25 various nationalities. Academic and training staff, 10 various nationalities. Feel home away home. Choose ATCWA for your bright professional career. Connect with us and get help. Okay, and I will play another testimonial video of one of our students. Okay. Hi, my name is Alden May Amlerua. I'm 26 years old. I am from Davao City, Philippines. And currently taking diploma of business here in Australian Technical College. So my tatlong reason kung bakit ko napili ang Australian Technical College. First reason is that it is very accessible in doing public transport. Second, it offers state of the art quality education. And third, which is the main reason kung bakit ko napili ang ATCWA is that it offers a flexible type of payment o yung starter payment ng kanilang tuition fee. Being a working student here in the in here in Australia is really hard. So advantage talaga kung maka, kung makakahanap ka ng school na, na nag-offer ng flexible type of payment. And Yung, yung mga staff ng ATCWA, they are very, very accommodating. Um, one staff offered a help na hanapan ako ng trabaho, which is really, I'm so blessed by it kasi nga, mahirap, mahirapan na maghanap ng trabaho dito. And kung pagdating mo dito, walang maka-accommodate sa'yo or walang tutulong sa'yo, which napakahirap talaga. So, Good thing na ang ATCWA may mga staff sila na ready to help in terms of the of your accommodation, in terms of job, um, kahit ano pa mga kailangan mong asikasohin, tutulungan at tutulungan ka talaga nila. So, for those of you na gusto mm, ma-pursue yung Australian dream nila, um, I highly, highly recommend ATCWA because it really... When you graduate and you came from ATCWA, you are job ready and ready to conquer or to pursue your dreams in life. Renat Usada, 26 years old, galing sa Tandaga, Surigao, Lulu Sur. Dumating ako dito ng December 12, kasama ang husband ko. Dito ako nag-aaral sa Australian Technical College of Western Australia. I'm taking up Certificate of Commercial Cookery 3. Pinili ko yung Perth kasi nandito yung family ko. Hindi lang doon, pinili ko dahil sa course kong nanaitapos sa Pilipinas, which is Hotel and Restaurant Management, is very suits here kasi marami marami ditong hotels and restaurants um, you must dis must disadvantage yun sa mga ma may course na hotel and restaurant management um, there are lots of restaurants and um, hotels and 
everything. Um, why I choose ATCWA? Pinili ko yung ATCWA kasi according to my research, yung ATCWA is nearby from the transportation, which is the train and the bus station. Um, they also offering uh, installment basis sa tuition fee nila. Ang um, yung mga staff dito are very friendly, polite, and they are willing to help most of the people here, and especially to the Filipino people. Dahil nga, pag bumangta ka dito, ang hirap maghanap ng trabaho. Yung kahit yung sabi mo na um, tapos ka, eh wala yun dito. Kailangan mo talaga magtsaga, maghanap ng trabaho. So, one of the stop here, um, it's a Filipino guy. Um, sinabi, uh, they, they offer me a job. And yun, and luckily, tinawagan ako agad ng employer na yun nga, may pwede na ako pumasok doon. So, for, the, for my message to all of you who, wants, who are interested applicants to apply here in ATCWA, um, I'm I highly recommend um, ATCWA because they are giving us the high-level education program and when you graduate, you have job already. That's all. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Thanks for your patience. Um, so... I believe you can hear me. You can see me. Um, um, and um, can we continue? Can, can we continue from here? Yes, sir. Go all ahead. Good. Yeah. So all good. Yes, yes it's all, all good. good. Okay. Okay. No worries. So I'll stop. Um, okay. I'll I'll share my PowerPoint slide as well. Yes. Please. So uh, first of all, I would like to thank all of you guys for joining us today. And uh, we are very pleased that we are, you know, um, working with such a great company, Visa Center. And they have been very great to us and they have been referring us a lot of students. And we have a great testimonials with them and all the students who they have referred are doing really fine with us. So at ADCWA, we do have a large range of courses. And we do have um, our campuses in Sydney and Melbourne, uh, Sydney and Perth. Sorry, um, uh, twist of tongue. So Sydney and Perth. Perth is in the same time zone of uh, the Philippines. Whatever the time is over there, it's the same time over here. Um, we are um, very near from, uh, uh, you know, uh, from Philippine. It's just eight hours flight maximum. And then uh, uh, we have a great coastal line, so which allows you guys to, uh, you know, um, uh, to be connected with your family and you can enjoy the same life you want to enjoy back in Philippines. I know Filipinos are uh, sea people, so uh, Perth offers a lot in terms of, you know, um, the similarity of your lifestyle over there, but with more security and safety. We do have 24,000 Filipinos already living here in uh, Perth, and um, we are glad to share that we do have one campus in uh, Sydney too. So uh, why you should choose ADCWA? Because we offer the quality training. We have multilingual and multicultural staff. We do have students from uh, various nationalities and we do have a large number of students studying from Philippines with us as well. Uh, from past many years, we have graduated hundreds of Filipino students and we are very proud and humble on that. So we do have a great and easy payment plan. Um, we offer free airport picker. We can guide you for the accommodation for free. We can offer you the affordable fee structure and we can offer you a good fee payment plan as well. So Perth has been ranked and from past 13 years in top 10 most livable cities in the world. Um, we in terms of safety, security and standard of living. Um, we are just near to Philippines. Um, luckily, we now do have a campus in Sydney too. So we do have a great mix of nationalities living over here. A large number of Filipinos are definitely part of that, uh, you know, um, our good community. So we are one of the affordable Australian capital city. Um, um, weather is great. 94% students feel safe in Perth. Work opportunities are there. We are the financial capital of Australia. We are 34% of Australian economy. So we're doing really fine in Perth, in Western Australia. And we can definitely find great opportunities for our students as well. Affordable accommodations 
um, as uh, one of the key. Uh, you can work 40 hours per fortnight over here in um, standard uh, situation, but at the moment you can work full time as an international student. Uh, so there's no limitation on the work and students are making a really good money in terms of, you know, the living. So in Perth, every um, um, where we are located in Perth, uh, we do have uh, two big movie screens over there. Um, every other street has a has a park. Every park has a barbecue facility in it. Every second park got a gym in there. Uh, and uh, Perth, uh, within CBD, we are based in CBD. We are in center of CBD. Within CBD, transportation is totally free and 50% discount for the international students when they go out of the CBD or when they go out of the city and they move interstate. So accommodation and um, transportation is affordable, way affordable than other states. Okay, now talking about the courses, um, I'll just give you a quick overview of the courses. Uh, we do have uh, advanced diploma civil construction design. Uh, we do have advanced diploma of IT, telecom network engineering. We do have uh, cyber security, advanced diploma of cyber security. We do have diploma community service. We do have graduate diploma management learning. We do have um, uh, diploma of business, advanced diploma of leadership and management. Uh, we do have, uh, um, you know, cert for commercial to create diploma of hospitality. We do have advanced diploma of hospitality as well. So we got the great range of courses which can help you to uplift and build your career over here in Australia. Most of our courses, um, they have a great career opportunity. You can go for the TR after those courses. And during the, your TR, if you earn 1,725 hours work experience with most of the courses, uh, you may be eligible for the PR as well. So for the permanent residency and everything, we can connect you with our migration team, um, our migration lawyers, they can guide you for that as well. So um, that's what we have uh, in Perth. And we do have a campus in Sydney too. In Sydney, we do have advanced diploma of hospitality. Uh, we do have advanced diploma of IT telecom. We do have advanced diploma IT cybersecurity. We do have um, community service, um, civil construction design, and graduate diploma management learning. So that's all what we have at ADC. Um, so please come and join ADC in Perth or uh, Sydney campus, and we would love to help and assist you as much as we can. Thank you very much, Juni. Over to you. If you have any questions or if any of the participant is having any question, we can go ahead with that. Okay. Thank you so much, sir, for, uh, let's, let's check with our presentation. Okay. So we were going to read, uh, of course, some questions from our viewers, but just an update, uh, Mr. Asif, uh, Mr. Ali is, we just like to know, uh, Australia now is actually open, right? So all of your students are, yes, all good now. So there's nothing to worry about that. So my, my first we're question of, is... We are, yeah. we are one of the safest places in the world. Wow. Yeah, right? That's it's great Australia. to hear. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So when is the next intake available? I mean, for July. our viewers who would like to... We do to have start. April intake. We, we do have April intake. We have July intake. We have October and we have January. So oh, January, have January, April, um, July, October. Four intakes in a year. Mm-hmm. That, that's good to know as for our students. Uh, my follow-up question to that is, let's say, if one of our viewers now are really interested to start their application with the Visa Center, um, whether this, how long uh, do they have to wait for them to, let's say, get enrolled and, let's say, move to Australia? Okay. So when you apply with us, if your documents are all good, um, definitely when it comes to the visa center, you have expert team and you upload all the relevant documents and you fill all the relevant forms uh, regarding your um, student admission. So probably you'll get the offer letter within one day if they come through with the visa center uh, because you, you guys are professional team and you are looking after everything very, very well. So within one day, you can go ahead with your um, you know offer letter. And um, once you've got your offer, you can prepare for your GT documents and everything. Um, uh, visa center can guide you and help you for the GT documents. Once we got your GTE, once we got your payment, you can get your COE within 24 hours. Wow, that's very fast process. Um, yeah. But my question is, um, do we does our student has to pass the IELTS? Is it required for no. your school? 
since, now since since immigration is not requiring IELTS, and I personally know many of Filipinos that do have uh, very good communication skills, and uh, yes. we don't have any trouble with most of our Filipino students. Uh, we have graduated hundreds of Filipino students already, so there's no trouble at all. So we do have our own LLN test. They can go ahead with that LLN test. And once they mm -hmm. appear for that LLN, that's online test, that's for free. And if they uh, if they clear that test, no problem. We don't need any IELTS or TOEFL or PD. Nothing is needed. Mm -hmm. Okay, that, that's actually yeah, always that's good, good. Or, or viewers <laughs> partner. Because, you know, yeah. uh, everybody knows already that if it's uh, for Australia, for student visa, IELTS is waived. Okay, but the question now, sir, is for those who are watching right, right now that they don't have any relatives in Australia, especially in your school location like Sydney. No problem. Yeah. No problem. Uh, how about the accommodation? I'm the, I'm, the, I'm, the, I'm the relative. I will look after them. Don't worry. <laughs> so you're the relative of all the Filipino people who go there. Well, that's true, great. True, 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 true. <laughs> what happens is um, I have been, I'm a first generation migrant. I have been to many countries. Um, yes. I know. I know international students, I know them, um, how good they are, and I know uh, where they suffer, and I know how to support them. So we are very much connected with the Filipino community and the other communities as well. So we have no problem to look after them. We can offer them free or pickup. We can guide them for the accommodation. We can guide them for every single thing, uh, which can help them to ease them uh, to make sure that they're productive part of society and they're doing their uh, learning in a better way. All right, that, oh, that's, that's good, good to, to hear. hear. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Okay. So to our viewers, guys, if you have questions, some more questions, although we have already a, a well explained um, story and support of uh, of our school partner, and of course we have here Mr. Ali to, to really give you guys the first hand information. <laughs> okay. So I think while waiting for some of our audience to to ask question. So, so I just like to know, let's say for our applicants right now, or to our viewers, I mean right now, uh, if they are like planning to bring their family as well, especially if they are a couple, something like that. So uh, that also possible, correct? Yes, it's also possible, but I would recommend to all... <laughs> Excuse, sorry. Okay, Bless sorry. you. God bless. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I would I would recommend all the international students um, to not burdenize themselves initially. Mm -hmm. And initially, uh, the student um, should come here, settle down, and make sure that everything is right. Continue with their studies and find some part-time job, find reasonable accommodation, and then call your partner and call your kids and all that to okay. join you over there. Yeah. So yeah. I don't want them to suffer because... It will be the next step. <laughs> yeah, one, one, once yeah, once they come as a family, one step at a time. Yeah, yeah, a lot of challenges. So I would recommend them to come over here first and then settle down themselves. And once they settle down, then they can bring the family. No issues. Okay, maybe my partner has a question. Well, my question would be, <laughs> how um around how much will they need to prepare to be enrolled to your school? I don't know um, about your um, expenses because Visa Center definitely would be having some charges as well for the services. Um, but for us, uh, for school, for health cover, for uh, visa application and all that, probably if they have around four to five thousand dollars initially with them, would be great. Would be great. Yeah. That's that's Australian dollars, right? Yes. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we okay, have so a we question. Have here. Mm -hmm. Yes. From Ivan James, uh, he's asking if what is the common course that Filipino students are actually taking from your school? What is the yeah, famous but, course? Uh, well, Filipinos, they're interested in uh, uh, telecom network engineering. They're interested in cybersecurity. Oh. Uh, they're interested mm -hmm. in civil construction design. They're interested in community service. Uh, they're interested in commercial cookery and hospitality. So Filipinos are pretty much going to all the fields and they are very good learners and we don't have any trouble training our lovely Filipino learners. Mm -hmm. that's okay, great. that's good. And then we have here another question partner coming from Cecil Bison. How many days a week you have to attend yeah, school? Two days a week. You have to attend the school two days a week and then um, five hours is e-learning hours. So pretty much two days if you come to school and then you do your five hours e-learning, you're pretty much sorted here. Yeah. 
Okay, so that will give them more time to focus on their part-time job, right? Yeah, yeah. I won't say I won't say that they should be uh, focusing uh, part-time jobs um, specifically. They should be focusing their studies. Part-time job as you know, as cherry on the top. So mm -hmm. enjoy the cherry, but enjoy the cake as well. So your yes, cake is course. your education. I agree. I agree. Yeah, enjoy your education. That's gonna help you with your career. That's true. Of course, the, the main uh, reason why you're studying in Australia is for you to have a better profile it's and true. having that diploma, right, from Australia will bring you to a better uh, position if, if you are wanted to... To a greener pasture, right? With Australian education, you can go to anywhere in the world and you can create your career in a better way. So if you are Australian educated, so then if you go to any place in the world, you will find a better job. That's for sure. Okay, Very I agree. Good. So, sir, so this is the point now. So, your, the location of your school is in Sydney, correct? Yes, please. Yeah, so it means that it since th this is Sydney, so if just for our viewers who might be worried that, you know, uh, yes, they have enough money for their tuition fees, but how they're going to survive in, in Australia. So, they are in Sydney, so it means there are a lot of uh, part-time job opportunity for them, especially for yeah. Filipino uh, in, in that place, correct? We don't have any trouble to help and guide our students uh, because mm -hmm. we do have great industry engagements and our industry partners, they always keep asking us for the uh, various, um, you know, employment opportunities for our students. And we keep posting those opportunities on our, you know, um, uh, you know, that help desk for the students. So there's no mm. issue at all. Um, they can definitely manage themselves. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's there's great no... that you have the school help yeah. desk, right? Yeah. There, and you yeah. mentioned in, and you mentioned that Sydney is a fina the financial capital of Sydney. So I believe mm -hmm. that it means that you have a lot of job to offer our uh, Philippine Yes. People. So we, we do we do have everything sorted in Philippine in uh, sorry in Perth and Sydney. Both places are good for the international students, so we can look after them very very well. Mm -hmm. In Perth, I can look after them way better because I'm settled over here from past many years. In Sydney, definitely we can support them too. No issues. Mm -hmm. So, sir, in, in one of your student testimonial video earlier, one girl mentioned about, you know, the, the school will going to, uh, no, no, no. Uh, what she said is that after the graduate, after she graduated, there will be an assurance of a job. So this is a question now, from we, Ivan. We are, Ivan we, are, yeah, we are not assuring any sort of uh, such things. Uh, we are not making any promises like that. But we make sure when we train you, we train you in a way that when you finish your studies with us, uh, you are job ready and you, you can be a productive part of the workforce and you'll have a lot of opportunities. Hmm. So we have trust upon our training. Okay, th that's good. At least, as far as I know from our previous episodes that you are with us, sir, here in our Facebook Live, that uh, your courses are actually the one who are in demand, okay, when it comes mm -hmm. to, like, jobs in Australia. So, you know, enrolling in your school and choosing whatever courses you're offering is already a right decision because you will definitely have a good opportunity to land a job in Australia if given a chance, right? True, true. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have here another question. Uh, is it necessary a college graduate to apply at ATCWA? It's hmm. not necessary. It's your choice. If you want to apply with us, you're most welcome. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Okay, and another comment from our viewer. We have Maria Jem. Uh, do you have any asking? other program aside yeah, from aside Australia? From Australia. Yeah. Yeah, for, for that, you can contact with the Visa Center. They definitely would be having any partners in Canada, UK, and other countries as well. So <laughs> you need to contact with the Visa Center. They can definitely guide you, assist you, and help you for the other, mm -hmm. other destination than Australia. But I can assure you one thing. There is no better place in the world than Australia. If you really want to relocate, if you really want to um, you know, go for another country, if you really want to migrate um, for economic purposes, um, I don't see any place better than Australia anywhere in the world. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. So we just have some viewers here from Kaloocan City. 
All right, hello to you. And of course, Mark Marasigan, I'd like to know how much is the accommodation inside the school or is it cheaper outside? Um, we don't have like how much? Yeah, we don't uh, have school okay. accommodation. Um, mm -hmm. But we can help you to find the affordable accommodation, no problem. But with the current, uh, with this, with the current rate right now, sir, do you have any average rate of how much will be in, the in cost? Perth, of... in, in, in Perth, average accommodation is the sharing accommodation is seventy to one hundred twenty dollars. Mm -hmm. Every fortnight. Yeah, in uh, per week. Per week, okay. Okay. And in in Sydney, it's around I would say one hundred fifty to two twenty dollars per week. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's good. And and considering, guys, Sydney, there are a lot of Filipino already in Sydney, Australia. So I think thinking about that, don't worry. Uh, the visa center will definitely going to help you out, naman. So it doesn't mean that not only once your visa is approved and you have to go yes. to Australia. And yeah, the support is coming from the school and also from the visa center as well. So <laughs> this is one question here <laughs> from from Mix. Okay, the answer here is no. Uh, for Filipino, no. we are not required for IELTS anymore. And nice to hear that I found a school like ATCWA, of course. Uh, Mr. Ali has been supporting us, and it is really good, guys, because he's not thank just you. representing the school, but he is thank, the director. Thank you. Thank, thank you, Pati Luna. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, the last question, lang siguro, partner. So, sir, I heard that you are traveling to Philippines and our yes, team is meeting you somewhere in Pampanga. Yeah. yeah, definitely we can catch up in Pampanga or I would invite your team. Uh, they can come and they can have lunch or dinner with me in um, BGC. Most probably I'll be staying at BGC so they can come and join me for lunch or dinner, whatever um, they're comfortable with. They can come and join me for that. And um, I can definitely quick catch up with them in Pampanga too. Well, sure, looking so forward to meet you. Yeah, we're just going to get your schedule. At least, you know, maybe our team can uh, like support yeah, sure. our... So are you based your, your your in Pampanga? Are you based in Pampanga? Oh, I'm based in Nueva Ecija. But it's very near Pampanga. Okay, okay. Mm. I'll probably, so I... probably will catch up with you um, over there. There is an Indian restaurant. Uh, it's called... Uh, Agni, I guess. So it's it's in the in, in the Pampanga uh, near to Clark. So yeah, definitely I, catch up with you guys over there. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, you're not, you're, oh, you, you will you love Indian food, food if you if you if you just yeah. try. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah, we are used of eating Indian food here in Dubai. Okay. Yeah. So the, there's we have viewer already who are interested with commercial cookery, especially you have this video testimonial from one Filipina student earlier. But for Let's say commercial cookery. How much will be the cost? The, 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 it's around twenty one thousand dollars, uh, twenty two thousand dollars for two years. You can pay in eight installments. Oh, okay, good oh, news. So they right, are so offering we... staggered payments. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I think we we don't have some more questions from our viewers, but I think we have. Uh, and uh, Mr. Ali already answered some of our question. And, but guys, if you have some more question, feel free to contact the Visa Center because we will be helping you out to answer all of your clarifications. What requirements do you need to prepare for you to be enrolled, of course, in, in the school? And at the same time, your process of ap applying for your visa. Okay, yeah. so you will be uh, in Australia because as we know, student visa is the fastest way to enter to Australia. Get. So, yeah. mm -hmm. So, all right, yeah. Juni, um, if, if you guys can allow me to leave because uh, people are sure. waiting for me at the dinner table. So, it's not very good uh, to <laughs> put them on hold. Uh, so, thank you very uh, very much, Visa Center. Thank you, Juni. Thank you, Annie. And it's great working with you guys. And we really believe that you are bringing us a good number of quality Filipino students. Thank you very much. And see you guys thank soon. You, thank, thank you, you thank so you. much. Right. God Goodbye. bless. Bye-bye. Okay, partner. So that's the director of uh, what's the name of the school again? It's Australian. Australian. Oh, let's go here. Australian Technical College, Western Australia. Yes. Okay. ACWA. At na natin ano ha, uh, mga student applicants uh, sa school na yan. It's because uh, super lalo na last year, no? Uh, we've been promoting.